Eric Shop. I'm here in Portland, Oregon. Uh, today we are working on the door bars for the bolt-in roll cage from Auto Power Industries. This is a track car, so it's not race legal to do this with a uh, race car, but this is the, one of the last steps that I need to do before going to the ridge on April 21st. So getting some hands-on experience with some of the fabrication tools that are involved with notching out roll bars and uh, pretty excited to be here. I'm thankful that Eric has me here and uh, was really looking forward to this day. So yeah, I'm glad you guys are here on my vlog and I hope you enjoy. It's not very perfect. A little off center because the tool's not very perfect. Yeah, but the weld... The weld will just fill all that in. It's just gonna fill it in. Yeah. How do you turn it on? Which is up on the left. Huh. So you gotta be real gentle with it. Okay. You look at this end, see how it's super sharp, mm -hmm. right? If you weld on that, because it's so, so thin, it'll just blow away. So you want to turn it into a nice thick piece of metal, you can weld on. If, you, if you're gonna go up that angle, you gotta go pretty steep and have a good hold on it, because it will grab out of your hands. Generally, you wanna be doing it this way, right? So the, the, the load's on this thing, and, the, and it's trying to cut across it this way. If you get this sharp edge into the into the paper, it'll catch the paper, tear the paper, and throw this piece. Yeah, you're gonna do the top one first, or the bottom one first? Uh, what do you recommend? The bottom one, so do we can appraise? I think we should do the bottom one first. I kind of agree. Eric has helped me weld one side. One side's done. We've decided we're gonna go and weld these joints here, which would make my life a lot easier as well. Uh, and so I'm working on, we just tacked weld this far. I'm working on appropriately placing it here, marking where I need to grind off the paint. Then he'll come and weld this and weld that. And then we have the harness net to do and the cool shirt and that'll be it. Alright, day two of welding. We ran out of gas last night. So we're picking back up this morning. Eric's looking at me like, who are you talking to? I'm talking to the people of YouTube. You have something to say? I wanna not, not catch a car on fire. Oh, I'm just, they're getting, I'm getting. I'm having trouble with my welder and so I'm getting big, tall, ugly welds. It's okay. Like this, this is like, hey look, nice welds, nice welds, like blah. <laughs> so I want to put it here, and I marked. But I wanted to ask your opinion on if I if we just weld the corners here. So this is the finished product here. 